the designated hitter. Al Martin. The wide to kick the pitch. Fought off foul. And the righty deals. Yep. To the right side. Steps on first for the out. And now the center fielder, Andy Van Dyke. The center fielder, Andy Van Dyke. And first offering is fouled off. One down, base is empty. Swings through that one. Filthy changeup right there. Just pulled the string. And down on strikes. That's out number two. Two outs, base is empty. Barry Bonds getting ready to hit. First pitch just misses. Two outs. Two oh count to a guy with this much pop at the dish. You better expect him to be turning on something. It's going to either get hit hard to the pull side or the fans better look out in the stands. And a pitch. Swings and crushes one. Right field, way back, and gone. That one felt good, and they grabbed the lead. It's 1-0. So two away with nobody on. Here's the third baseman, Bobby Bonilla. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Righty delivers. And a foul ball. I think it's huge that they were able to score right away. You're playing on the road. Stakes are high. Energy in the ballpark. Oh. And you help to quiet that down a little bit. The pitch. Started to swing. Held up. Almost got him to commit, but he held back. And he walked him. I don't think he really wanted to pitch to him right there anyhow. Orlando Merced will hit next. He's someone that really beats up on right-handed pitching. The lefties, however, give him a little bit more trouble. And that's in there for strike one. The pitch. That one misses. One ball, one strike. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. Bonilla, the runner at first with two gone. Next pitch is outside. Just missed. Great RBI spot here. Just got to stay focused on the pitch. The runner will be in motion, so something in the gap should definitely score it. Slice the other way. That's a base hit. They stopped the lead runner at second. Now two on with two outs. Fastball off the plate a little bit, but a really nice job of going with it. Punched it to the opposite field for that knock. At the plate for Pittsburgh, Jay Bell. That one a little bit high. And that's ball one. At this point, the clean inning is over. Got to settle in, focus on the hitter, and get out of it with minimal damage. First and second, two down. Hey. Next pitch in for a strike. And a count even, one and one.
Good eye in that spot. It's a good take. And now it's three and two. Righty to the plate. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. Good. Here's the shortstop at the play. Ozzy Smith. You talk about elite defensive players, especially in the middle of the diamond, and this guy is at the top of the list. And the first pitch misses in the dirt. And you played behind guys, and they love having your speed out there defensively. One of the things that we talk about is how much pitchers enjoy having those elite defenders behind them. Now 3 and 0. Oh. Boog, and the one thing about that is speed never goes in a slump. And defense shouldn't either. Hitting-wise, you can struggle, you can lose your mechanics. But the thing that you can do consistently every single game is play great defense if you're talented in that way. And this is what this guy does. Foul ball, and it remains a full count. Lifted in the air, right center field. Makes the grab on the run. And there's one away. Brian Jordan, next up for the Cardinals. That pitch in for a strike. And it's 0-1. Really good cutter that he's able to front door and back door. That pitch is devastating. This ball's chopped on the ground. And foul ball. 0-2 now. On the ground. And it's through for a hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Back against the wall with two strikes, but found a way. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. Now, Pedro Guerrero. And there's a foul ball. Now move to first. Jordan back easily. The 1-1. One, one. Runner on the goal. Shoots a line drive single into right center. Into third now. So runners at the corners and one out. That is cool. And now, number 27. And a strike in there. The last thing he wants is to hit the ball on the ground, but I wouldn't expect many pitches up in the zone. They'll be pitching for a double play in this spot. First and third, one down. Gets under and pops it up. And that'll fall for a base hit. Now two away as they get a run across. So up next, number 12. The pit pit. And that's ripped in the left. Base hit. Throw in holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. Geronimo Pena digs in now. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Swing and a miss, and he got him to chase. Talk about tying a guy up. That was ugly. The next pitch misses. Two and one. Could be some action here on this next pitch. Couple runners on. Probably a challenge pitch coming. <laughs> Two. 
tied up here in the early going. Pitcher having a pretty tough time getting that swing and miss. Third foul ball in a row. Here's a 2 2. Bows that off to the left and will do it again. Well, having such a tough time putting him away. Six foul balls in a row. Man, what a battle. Here comes a pinch. Foul off the plate. They'll do it again. This is something else. Running that pitch count off, I can't imagine how frustrating it must be for the pitcher to have so many good pitches spoiled off like this. Checks his swing. Now it appeal to third. Yes, he did. Down he goes on strikes. Back here at the ballpark. New inning getting started. Here's the second baseman, Jeff King. Smith back to work. A little bit low. All one, no strike. And that one off the outside edge. Got it started a little too early. Strike one. And now it's even up. The line of the pitch. Still two and two after the foul ball. And the right hander deals. Got him. One gone here. Number two, the next pirate to hit. In there, and it's on one. Now wanted a one. One two now. That's down and in. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Kicks and fires. Struck him out looking. Lenny Webster, the next pirate to hit. That one's in there, 0 and 1. And here it comes. That one missed. Strike two. Good late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good. And then by the time he gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. In the dirt. On to first. That's the third out. And welcome back. Bottom half of inning number two. And stepping in for the Cardinals, number 34. The right hander back to work. Inside just missed. Ripped on a line. Bonds brings it in with a nice run and grab. And stepping in is the speedy number 25. And nope. ball one. Ball the next two. offering misses. Ball two. The only adjustment he needs to make is his target. If you aim at the outside corner, that slider's going to end up way off the plate. Perhaps look a little more down the middle, and you get it right where you want it. There's a strike, three and one.
Next offering is foul back. The pitch. Got him swinging. Couldn't catch up to the heater. Ray Sanford next up for the Cardinals. On the outside corner, 0-1. Left-hand hitter waits. He swings and fouls one off. Mm -hmm. Right hander kicks deals. Knocks that one away and we'll do it again. The wind in the pitch. Foul ball still 0 and 2. Just misses with that one. Foul ball still a one and two count. Left hand batter waits. Swing and a pop off in foul ground. Bonilla brings it in for the third out. Top half of the third inning. Here's a speed threat. Al Martin. Martin measures six feet two inches 200 pounds and though usually in left field today he's the designated hitter and the 1 0 some guys don't like not being able to play defense because it helps him to stay in the rhythm so for him to be the DH we'll see if he gets a routine together the 1 1 is fouled off He swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Sanford drifts towards it. And there's one down. Up next for the Pirates, Andy Van Dyke. His first hit bat was a strikeout. Andy Van Dyke. Ball one, no strikes. Kicks and deals. To third. In plenty of time to first. And that quickly, two away. So next to the plate for Pittsburgh, Barry Bonds. He's already homered in this game. First pitch, and he just misses. Bonds, in his 10th season, hitting third in the lineup. And he's a former Silver Slugger recipient in the National League. He's trying to stay away from this lefty, knowing that a lot of left-handers like the ball down and in. That misses, and a count two and one. Just missed. Three balls, one strike. The pitch. Gets a piece and stays alive. The pitch. Swing and that ball smashed on a line. Puts the squeeze on that one and that'll end the inning. Welcome back. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now up for St. Louis, Ozzie Smith. And he deals. Trying to bunt his way on. And he barehands it. It's there, and that's a great play. He was out early today working on that very play. Jordan, 27 years old, a former first-round pick in 2022. Jordan batting for the second time, and that's strike one. Close one doesn't get the call, and it's one and one. Swing and a miss. One ball, two strikes. That misses the zone. Two balls, two strikes. Outside. He should get a pretty good pitch to hit here with three-hole hitter coming up if he's wrong. 
The 3 2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Oh, he tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. Hitter didn't offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. Here's the pitch. Runner goes. Ball outside. And that's a stolen base. Not even close. Runner at second here, one gone. Swung on, belted. That one carrying. And it is gone. He sends it out of here. And it gives him the lead in the third. It's 3-1. Number 27 now at the plate. He's 0 for 1. First offering, and it just misses. Still only one out here in the inning. That one's in there. That's strike one. Hey. Goes down looking. Here's the catcher, number 12. One for one with a single so far. And there's a ball. Next offering is in for a strike. And look out as that one ran in and got him. I don't care what some players might say. Nobody likes getting hit by a pitch unless you're in an 0-2 count and there's a knuckleballer out there on the mound. Pena, the next to hit, takes ball one. Next offering is down low. Well, he looks more focused at the plate and working the count after that first at bat strikeout. Misses with the 2 0, and he's fired three straight outside the strike zone. And that's ball four. Not what he wanted to do right there, Boo. That keeps this inning alive, puts a runner in the scoring position, and a chance for this offense to add on to their lead. And yeah, the batter now, number 34. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Two outs, a couple of base runners at first and second. And strike two. No ball, two strikes. And right back to the mound. They take the force out. They limit the damage here. to the fourth stepping in the long ball threat Bobby Bonilla and the pitch hit on the ground to the right side dives but it kicks off his glove and he beats it he's safe went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle just a little roller to the pull side definitely out in front of the pitch away but it wasn't one the defense could make a play on and now Orlando Merced in for a strike going along. You know, these Pirates do a great job, Boog, of just waiting for the right pitch to come their way. And I'm seeing very patient at bats out of him. He's only given up one run, but the starter's pitch count is starting to get up there. And that might be the best news yet for this offense. Next offering is in for a strike. You know, sometimes all it takes is getting to the next arm before an offense does any damage. And that might be the case today. Started to go after it. Now we'll look down to third. And yes, he offered at it. At the plate for Pittsburgh, Jay Bell struck out swinging his first time. Bell. 
swing and a tapper that rolls foul. And a pitch. And misses inside. And a pop up right side foul territory. Jordan racing over to make the catch. Now it's the second baseman, Jeff second King. Baseman. Jeff King. And first offering is fouled off. Good eye right there. And that is cut on and missed. One and two. Generally, second, third time through the lineup, you want to be able to lean on those secondary pitches and command them. Looks like he's doing a nice job of it. Got him. Picks up strikeout number seven. Bottom of the inning. Now the left fielder, number 25. No left fielder. Number 25. And the right hater back to work. And the first pitch misses for ball one. You know, these Cardinals doing a good job of putting the ball into play, and that makes things more challenging on the defensive side. And here's a stat for you, Boog. They're making contact with more than 85% of the pitches that they're swinging at. It's pretty special stuff. Not so good if you're out there on the mound. And a 2-1 on the way. And it's fouled away. Two two now. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Two two now. Bounce to the left side. Gets it to first. And one gone to the fourth as they get the leadoff man. Here's the center fielder, Ray Sanford. He popped out his first time. That hits the dirt. One and oh. And that's outside. The wind of the pitch. That misses the zone, and that's ball three. Great. Great strike right there. That one to first. He steps on the bag. Already two gone no here in the home no four. Ozzie Smith Ozzie. next up for the Cardinals. Smith. Up the middle. Sends it to first. Inning over. Back here at the ballpark. Ready now for the fifth inning. At the plate for Pittsburgh. Number two. The line to kick the pitch. And that's downstairs and outside. You know, these Pirates, as this game goes on, have to be more disciplined at the plate. They're chasing a lot of pitches outside the zone, and those chases that are turning into a bunch of outs, can they turn that around and stay within the zone? We'll see, but I think they have to. Pretty good pitch there to take a rip at. He wants to get his arms extended. He likes the ball away from him a little bit, just not able to square it up. Spoils that one, and it remains two and two. And a pitch. To the right side. Tosses to the pitcher, covering the bag. And the leadoff hitter retired in the fifth. Good fade and sinking action of that changeup. Got that hitter to roll over. Webster takes low second trip to the plate in this one. 
swings and misses and one and one righty delivers and there's a rocket into the outfield and now the lineup turns over with one away now so the lineup flips over Al Martin the next pirate to hit swing and a foul straight back Webster at first one gone and a foul ball Two now. And down on strikes he goes. And there's two down. Andy Van Dyke, the next to hit. And first offering is fouled off. And the pitch. And fouled off. The pitch. One ball, two strikes. And another ball. Two two on the way. Up the middle. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. That leaves him without a throw, and that leaves them with runners at first and second. First and second, two down. Up next for the Pirates, Barry Bonds. He's already homered here in this one. First pitch, just misses. Two outs. Inside, ball two. Outside corner for a strike. In today's game, not that many fastball counts, but hitters still in the back of their minds, they're looking for one. 2 0 changeup call right there. Excellent pitch selection to go with. They get the force, and that is that. Welcome back. We head to the bottom of the fifth. And stepping in for the Cardinals, Brian Jordan. Here comes a pitch. Bunting for a hit. And he grabs it in foul ground. Here comes the 0-1. And a foul ball. pitch bounce to third Bonilla to first and the leadoff man set down in their half of the fifth Pedro Guerrero next up for the Cardinals coming off an absolute bomb in his last at bat and first offering is fouled off that one down the line can't glove it cleanly not in time he's safe oh this has been a really nice game at the plate for him he looks locked in that pretty much split the zone down the middle and those are the ones where you got to make them pay next to hit number 27 foul back our way and that's out of play runner on the goal Next offering is foul back.
And the right hander deals. That's a ball. Misses That's inside. Ball. It's two and two. Battling here as he fouls it away. Just misses. Three and two now. He's been trying to tease the zone with that slider, but these hitters have showed patience not going outside the strike zone. High fly ball out towards left field. That's back. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man, I love that route. The ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. Turned his back on the infield. Got to the spot, turned around, and made a nice catch. Swing and the ball hammered. Left field. Back there. And that one is out of here. A shot to the opposite field. And they boost their lead. It's 5-1. And now it's the switch hitting second baseman, Geronimo Pena. Just a slow ground ball this time. And he picks it up and he'll put it in his pocket. And now the 1 and the pitch is outside, ball one. Well, just about to hit that century mark, 100 pitches for this game. This to third. Whips it to first. And the inning is over. Welcome back. Now the third baseman, Bobby Bonilla. Bonilla, in his 10th season, 31 years old, and he won the silver slugger at his position in the National League last year. That's a little bit low. Swings and crushes one. Right field, way back, and gone. A solo shot, and they cut into the deficit. It's 5-2. And here is Orlando Merced. And that's in there for strike one. Always exciting oh, to see a leadoff home run in an inning. Kind of gets the offense fired up, and you start to expect a big inning. The 0-1. Slapped foul. Going to count one and two. Ball set to throw pitch number 100. He needs a quick inning here if he's going to be able to make it through six complete. Ripped on the ground a second. Tosses to first. And that's the first out. Nice recovery after giving up the homer. Jay Bell, the next pirate to hit. In there, and it's 0-1. Well, you can't really adjust your game plan for that last pitch. Guy hasn't thrown it very much. you got to focus on the stuff that he's throwing up there most of the time. No ball, Strike, Strike two. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. So two down now, and here is Jeff King, who's over for two with a pair of strikeouts. A little roller up along first. And that is that. Steve Cook taking over on the mound. And this could be a pretty critical point in this game. They're hoping he's the guy to keep him within striking distance. Now pitching for the Number 26. And here it comes. Number 34 in the box now. No balls and a strike. Some guys are just more confident they can track that first pitch out of the hand of the pitcher. They don't care if they fall behind 0-1. Owen oh, oh, two as he waves at that one. The pitch. Foul ball. It stays nothing in two. He wanted that fastball high and tight, looking for a strikeout. Just didn't locate it very well. And that just misses. That one not close. Two balls, two strikes. 
The wind of the pitch. Try to get him to chase on the change up that time. Got it by him for the K. Number 25. Next up for the Cardinals. He's someone that you might not describe as having elite level speed, but he can absolutely move, and it is a factor in his game. There's a strike. Boy, this guy's definitely a plus runner, but what I love about him is that he goes all out every single time, never takes a break. It's guys like that, even though they don't have the elite speed, the fact that they're consistent with it, they make moves on the base paths. Next pitch misses. Ball one. In the dirt. Tosses to first. Two up, two down. Just not a good pitch to swing at. One reason he's an everyday player is he usually lays off of that jump. Swing it a foul straight back. Cook, 24 years old, and he's one of the few players in Major League Baseball born in Hawaii. Next offering is foul back. Here's the 0-2. And now one and two. Sneaks through, base hit. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. Still able to come through behind in the count right there. Just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. The ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity. Right on top of it. Smith stands in now and watches strike one. A switch hitter batting right. Sanford leads off first with two down to the inning. Next offering away upstairs. There goes the runner. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. The 1-2. That one just misses. That's inside. 3-2, two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitter's got to stay focused on the pitch. Over to first, and he's saved. On the ground, right side. And that ends the inning. Here at the ballpark, top of inning number seven, and now the first baseman, number two. And he deals. In there for a strike at the bottom of the zone. There's the strike. Right hander kicks, deals. Just missed. Fights it off, you'll see another. And a one two again. That one drifts inside. Bounced up the middle. Smith handles this one. Whips it to first on the run. One up, one down. Talk about being able to dial up the velocity. That first baseman over there might need a little pad inside that first baseman's mitt. And a foul ball left side. The one Late that time, and it's strike two. In the dirt. And two away to start the seven. You're best when you let the game come to you. Try to make too much happen right there. Not as best at bat. And that one fouled off. You'll 
at the ball. There's a strike. Well, he had a pretty good look at that pitch and not sure exactly what tied him up there. Couldn't pull the trigger. And perhaps the best pitch you'll see in this at bat to him. Up the middle. On the run. Throw to first. And that is that. Set for the last half of the seventh. Digging in. Brian Jordan. Cook back to work. And the pitch a little bit low. Ball one. And a good eye there. The wind to kick the 2-0. That one fouled off. The 2-1. Fought off foul. 2-2. Knocks that one away, and we'll do it again. The wind and the pitch. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Bonds on the move to the alley. Hauls it in after a long run. Going up one down. Everyday during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of balls in the gaps. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Guerrero, batting with one down, takes a strike. Ripped to short. Gathers and throws to first. Two up, two down. So now it's the four hole hitter, number 27. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Van Dyke right there to make the grab. And that's the third out. New pitcher for the Cardinals, Mark Clark. Now the number two hitter, Andy Van Dyke. One for three. The wind of the pitch. Oh, it's critical right here that they bear down and turn in some quality at bats. Try to chip away at that lead because if it gets to the ninth, that closer's coming in. On the ground. And that's just foul. Right handed reliever. And a breaking ball drops in for a strike. Here's a one two. Next offering is outside. Left hand hitter waits. Foul ball, another two two upcoming. Left hand batter waits. On the ground to third. Lead-off man is out here in the eighth. Good sinker low in the zone right there and produced exactly what he was looking for. Ball on the ground, nice ground out. Bonds, the next to hit, takes outside. Next offering misses, and that's ball two. Here's a strike. That one pulled foul. He's begging, give me that pitch one more time. A hanging changeup just out in front. And it's filled up. Still just the second batter of the inning. And on the mound, he's already thrown 13 pitches. They've got him working hard out there. Swings through him for the K. Pulled the string on the changeup. Next to bat will be the Pittsburgh cleanup hitter, Bobby Bonilla. Hit an absolute tape measure shot last time up. 
First offering misses the mark. Kicks and fires. This one chopped on the ground, but foul. Righty to the plate. Fights that one away, still one and two. Ground ball up the middle, Pena. Out number three. And welcome back. Ready for the bottom of the eighth. And here's the catcher, number 12. Number 12. The pitch. And that one a little bit high. Popped up. Grabs it on the run. And there's one away. Now here is Geronimo Pena. Foul ball there. And a pitch. A little bit high. And that's ball one. And strike two. One ball, two strikes. This one in the air center field. Van Dyke puts it away. And there's two away. Number 34. Yeah, that, next up for the Cardinals. Flips the corner, strike one. Back toward him with the breaking ball. Just got the corner. There's nothing you can really do with that. Next offering down in the dirt. Two down, nobody on. So now one and two. Throwing the ball well, and they need the scoreless inning in relief right here. Been doing a good job keeping him in striking distance. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. We're back. It's the top of the ninth, and there's a new pitcher on the mound, Lee Smith. And I can't imagine any save is an easy one. You're holding a small lead on the scoreboard, and you know those hitters are going to give you the best at bats they can. So it's always high stress. Let's see what he's got here to try and close it out. Now here is Orlando Merced. And a pitch. Smith, a former All-Star. He features a four-seam fastball, a slider, and he works in a two-seamer. Next pitch is inside, now 2-0. and oh. Oh, He never moved because he never had time to. But that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. That's a bullet, but it goes foul. And a pitch. There's a swing and a miss. Cold night like tonight. Last thing you want to do as a hitter is get jammed or even off the end. Trying to find that sweet spot on the bat. Tell you what, you're going to be trying to catch things out front. So off speed pitches may be a good complement to that fastball. And the batter will be the shortstop, Jay Bell. Struck out on just three pitches last time. And that is in for a strike. And it's 0-1. Well, this is just par for the course these days. Huge fastballs coming out of the bullpen. And the next pitch is way outside. And here it comes. Up the middle. What a stop. Over to first. And he gets him. Nicely done. Oh, boy, we talk about how the ball is coming out of a pitcher's hand. The way it comes out of his hand as an infielder. Wow, really impressive. King in the box with two gone and it takes a look at a called strike. Come back to the mound. Throw to first. Ball game. And the Cardinals take the series opener here at.